So this is how to install and use Mel in DS. I don't know why you'd want to, because you could just get this for me, which is way better. Anyway, go to this website and download whatever works with your PC. Then go here and scroll down to Nintendo DS BIOS and firmware and download that too. The links will be in the description, of course. You're gonna need 7-zip or WinRAR to extract these. So we'll go ahead and do that. Open the Nintendo DS BIOS firmware folder. Coffee BIOS NDS 7, 9 and the firmware bin. Paste it inside the Mel NDS folder. Rename BIOS NDS 7 to BIOS 7. Dot in and rename BIOS NES 9 to BIOS 9 dot in. It's ready to launch, but I'm assuming you haven't downloaded any games yet. So you can come back to this website and scroll down to NDS ROMs and find whatever game you want. For this example, I'll do Curvy Superstar Ultra. You'll probably want the one that's for your region. So at the end, there will be letters like U and EU, or just E and uh, J. J is Japanese, U is United States, and E or EU is Europe. Once you find the right one, click download links and download. You'll probably have a capture like this. Then go to direct download and download it. You'll probably have to unpack the game download too, so do that. You only need the NDS file. You can make a new folder, name it ROMs, and put all your games in there. You drop the ROMs folder into the Mel NDS folder. Then launch Mel NDS. Open the config, you'll see that there's almost no settings you can change. The only thing worth looking at is the input config. Click File, Open ROM, and navigate to your ROMs folder. Double click the game and it should launch. If the window is too small, you can manually resize it. And you'll also notice that this messes up the resolution. There's no way to fix that. There's also no way to adjust the volume, so you'll have to do that on your volume mixer, or just adjust your PC volume. Also, if you have a not very good PC like mine, you'll notice that it lags and has audio cracks every time you do something mildly strenuous. So that's pretty much all you need to know about Melon DS. If you can, I'd recommend not ever using it, just get definitely a video for installing and using that too. Thanks for watching, bye.